This is a wheel of NBA MVPs. And we're going to go ahead and spin and score with every single one from this wheel. And the first one we're scoring with is going to be Nikola Jokic. And it's pretty good that we got the newest MVP here. But our challenge for this one right here to score with him is just do a simple post fadeaway just like that. And there we go. And basically, we're going to do this process for every single player that's on this wheel. We got a certain challenge we got to complete. And next, we got LeBron James. LeBron James. And we're also going to be seeing a bunch of classic teams like this one right here. We're using the Heatles. And our challenge for this game is to get a contact dunk with LeBron. So I'm just going to run around right here and see if I can get myself into the paint. Oh my god! I did not expect that to work for the first try right here. He pushes him and dunks right on Zach Levine right there. Next up on the wheel, we're spinning it again, obviously, and we're gonna get this time... Stephen Curry. Like Curry. And we gotta use the 2016 Warriors right here. And our challenge for this game is gonna be to hit a limbless three with Curry. So let's see if we can hit like a crazy deep three with him right here. First try again? Oh no. <laughs> Oh, here we go. We got a chance to do what he did against the Thunder right here. Pulling up for Limitless. Ooh. And how is he already cold? He just missed two shots. Oh, here we go, Curry. Hit him with the little Curry slide. Step back right there and shoot the three from deep. Nope. All right, Curry. Go ahead and hit him with that Curry slide. Maybe a little bit of a step back. Oh, we're already at the end of the first quarter. <laughs> All right, Curry is no longer cold, so let's hit him with like a little bit of between the legs right there. Maybe hit him with a little Curry slide, a little momentum, and step back because he's actually guarding me. Fade away from deep two. Oh, here we go, Curry on the fast break. He's going to pull up from pretty deep right there. All right, here we go with Curry. We're going to go ahead and stop right here. Do a little Curry slide. Maybe do a little step back. Another Curry slide maybe as well. And then just shoot it right there. And that one went in. Let's go. That wasn't as deep as I originally wanted it to be, but you guys can see that's still pretty deep for a three. You sure about that? Once again, we're back here with the wheel. Who are we going to get this time? got all kinds of different MVPs here. And here's an older one, Shaquille O'Neal. So we're gonna go ahead and use the 2001 Lakers here and we're gonna do a simple challenge with Shaq. All right, we got the ball right here and my challenge is to get Shaq into the post and we're just gonna do a simple drop step. So let's actually get deeper into the paint. No way he's actually clamping me, what's going on? All right, let's try that again. We're gonna get Shaq into the post here. Let's just push Vucevic out of the way. We gotta get like a nice little dunk right here. And boom, that's his signature dunk too. That literally could not have worked out better. Look at that, little drop step just like he used to do. And boom, Shaq's signature dunk all over Vucevic. All right, here we are back at it again with the wheel. We'll be going to get this time, and now we got to score with Kobe Bryant. That's funny, and it's his teammate. And we're going with the 2004 Lakers this for this one right here. So we got no more uh, Froby. We actually got like, like almost balding Kobe, I think, at this point. And here we go, Kobe. Yeah, he's kind of like balding at this point. So we're going to score a pure Kobe shot. You're probably like, what is that? Over the backboard, fade away mid range, and I hit a first try. Don't even try to tell me this is not a Kobe shot. Look, that movie really falling out of bounds. It shoots all the way over the backboard and has to go in. All right, we're working our way through these MVPs. We got a decent amount left right here. So we're going to spin the wheel once again. And we're getting Michael Jordan. Okay. It became personal with me. We're going to use the 1998 Chicago Bulls for this one right here, the last dance. All right, so for this one, I want to try to trigger some, like, nice layup animation here. And, oh, my God, that was actually pretty nice. What the heck? I didn't even do any kind of Euro step either. I literally just, like, held square going into the paint. Look at that. This man went all the way around the defender and jellied around, too. We're going to spin the wheel again. If you're wondering why I didn't do, like, a post fadeaway or something, we just did that with Kobe. And now we got Giannis onto the Kumpo. So, obviously, there's no historic team for Giannis just yet. So, we're going to use the current Giannis for this. All right, here we go with Giannis. And our challenge is to do like a nice little euro step kind of dunk right here and that's a layup all right here we go on a fast break this is a good opportunity for Giannis right here let's go ahead and euro step and please dunk that somehow oh all right here we go once again with Giannis we need to get like a nice little animation here euro step and they're just holding me at the paint all right here we go with Giannis this might be a good animation and there we go and we're gonna go ahead and spin the wheel once again here and we're gonna get Allen Iverson get him, right. oh! and we had to use the 2001 Sixers here and we're gonna try to hit him with like a nice little combo and then hit like a nice like layup or something like that and i don't know how nice of a combo that was and that was a weird layup but it went in i guess like i don't know if alan iverson's ever gonna hit anybody with like a little like behind the back kind of like cancel right there and then go to the paint and do this weird contested layup but hey man let's go ahead and spin the wheel again we're getting close to the last mvp here and we got russell westbrook so they don't have MVP Westbrook's team in the game yet. So we got to use the 2012 Thunder. And what we're going to do here is we're going to actually throw in alley-oop to Russell Westbrook. And it has to be from KD as well. And there we go. Boom. Here goes Russell Westbrook going down into the paint. Gets the law from Kevin Durant. And boom. On a monopoe out here. You know what I'm saying? What? 
Alright, we only got five MVPs left, man. We're getting close to being to the final one. And now we got Joel Embiid. Now, if I wanted to be a professional hater, I could literally just say just go to the free throw line as a challenge. But we're going to hit him with like a nice little like shimmy up and under kind of thing. So like up and under. I almost actually got the free throw anyway, but there we go. So hit him with a little like little shimmy, kind of like a dream shape kind of thing. Up and under. Almost got the foul call anyway. Look, he should have. Oh, dear. The fish ended up on the filthy floor. Let's go ahead and spin the wheel again. Who are we going to get next? Which MVP we got to score with? And we're getting Dirk Nowitzki. You guys already know what we got to do with him. And of course, we got to use the 2011 Mavs when they won the championship. Oh, and we finally lost a jump ball. That's the first time I lost one in this video. All right, so basically what I grabbed Dirk right here and do a pretty deep post fadeaway. Probably like right around here. Do a nice little one leg post fadeaway. And green, there we go. Yeah! But there you guys go, the little one leg fade away. All right, we're down to the last three MVPs here. Who are we gonna get this time around? And we got James Harden. There's no classic Rockets team yet with James Harden on it. I think they're gonna have the Chris Paul team soon, most likely. So we gotta use the all-time Rockets here. Now there's two things we could do with them. We could either do like a nice little step back three, or we could do a nice Euro step. I don't know which one I'm gonna do. So you know what? We're just gonna do both in this video here. So here's James Harden, and let's go ahead and hit him with a step back three, just right away. Get that done. And now let's go ahead and grab Harden right here and do a nice little Euro step. Maybe we could even like sauce him up a little bit, like just like that, get him a little bit broken down. And I, I just true charge. I just charge right into him. All right, we're gonna try this again with James Harden here. Let's do a nice little Euro step into the paint. Oh, he dunked it too. And we get an action replay. A little Euro step right there, James Harden, finishing with the dunk. All right, we got the last two MVPs here. Which one we gonna have to do last? We'll figure it out right now. And we're going with KD this time around. And we're returning with the 2012 Thunder with Kevin Durant. A snack. A sweater I love. Nice. Alright, so my challenge here is to do a nice little pull up with Kevin Durant. I might already have it here on a fast break and everything, and he just went to the paint on his own. What the heck? Alright, let's try that again. We got Kevin Durant on a fast break right here, and I'm just gonna stop and pop right there. That's a Kevin Durant pull up, and it goes in. You can't tell me this doesn't look like a Kevin Durant type of pull up. Look at that right there. And then the final MVP that I score with is Derrick Rose right here. And we're going 2011 MVP Derrick Rose. I miss him so much. Let's do it and finish out this video. I wish the challenge would be make it to where he never got injured uh, and in real life, actually. But no, but we're going to do a hop step layup. That's kind of like his thing back in the day. It's what he was known for. Kind of like how he got injured for the most part, like a little like hop step layup just like that. Oh, wow. I missed. It's not the best layup package for 2K, at least, because you actually miss a lot with this. I used to have this. All right, here we go with D-Rose. Let's go ahead and get ourselves into the three-point line, go into the paint here, and do a nice little layup. And how does he... Oh, he almost got injured, too. That should have been the challenge, Luke. If I was a hater. Derrick Rose, injury. One on. All right, third time is the charm. Let's finish it out right here. Nice little hop step. Oh, all right, let's try that again. Third time's the charm. Let's go around the screen right here. Nice little hop step. And oh, well, bro, why is it so difficult? <laughs> okay, we're on a fast break. Maybe this is the perfect time for Derrick Rose to pull it out. Hit him with a terrible behind the back. I don't know what that even was. And they're just sticking on me. Oh my God, that speed boost. Go down into the paint. Time ran out, but it worked. I don't care. I'm counting that. And if you guys want to see another video, make sure you guys click the video that's on the screen right now. You guys will definitely enjoy it.